Hello, this is Craig. I wanted to show off uh, the basics, the early basics of the system that I have built for this game. Uh, so it starts off in a town where you can hire heroes, or rather talk to heroes. So you don't have to hire them because they're heroes. They work for free, or rather for whatever they happen to find. So right now this is placeholder art with just one hero, and you can recruit her. Now you can. The quests are all based on the heroes. Uh, there are no or very few quests outside of heroes. So whether or not the hero is in your party, you can get a quest from them. And the quest depends on their level and their person. So here we see a quest. Uh, this might look familiar if you've ever played FTL. I liked the idea behind FTL, although the basic. Uh, aside from the very very basic idea is completely different. Each of these nodes is a different node, a uh, different type of, of piece. Um, for example, the yellow ones are long but not very dangerous, the red ones are short but more dangerous, the black ones are long and dangerous. Uh, you get the basic idea. So you start here and you end up here and you can choose which path you take. This means that the quests aren't simply random uh, uh, fetch quests and boring crap like that. Instead, the quests are um, completely uh, unique each time, and they're always interesting, even though the actual goal is never explicit or important. The way in which you traverse the quest is always going to be a question of uh, best practices. Well, you know, how, how can we move through these? Uh, and therefore, it should be fun. Within each of these nodes is a battle um, situation where you're thrown into battle, but I don't have the connections built yet. The battle system isn't yet ready, so this is all I've got to show. And that's it.